What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. And uh, I got a surprisingly early delivery from Target this morning on a Saturday of uh, Memorial Day. So um, happy long weekend for everybody. So, yeah, Target never ships this fast. I don't know. Maybe something's changed. Um, but, uh, yeah, these are actually... I mean, I've seen people get these before release day, obviously. I've already seen people open up full cases, but um, was a little shocked with the Target drop, especially out here on the West Coast. We don't usually get them that quick. So these are the Optic Blasters. Got these for $29.99 on Target's website. Um, the difference between these and the Walmart ones is uh, these only have the pink parallels versus the purple shocks. But these are, um, they pretty much have everything in them. <laughs> Uh, things that used to be like cello pack exclusive or mega box exclusive it I think a couple people have mentioned now where I guess the thought is that this is going to be the only format this year for optic it's uh no megas and no fat packs or um which would be surprising but let's uh let's just rip into this and see what we get see if we can hit a downtown we hit a downtown last year troy palomalu um and uh you can hit the downtowns, the regular, and the Super Bowl downtowns. And uh, this is, um, I know, a lot for a lot of people, it's their favorite set. You know, I was starting to think about this, that um, this might be, I mean, I know this, this year's class has been kind of meh. Nice <laughs> McNabb hollow there. Desmond Ritter. Um, that... Um, I know for a lot of people, this is like the only football set they pick every year. I think between the three, Prism, Optic, and and Select, I think I might be in that same camp now. I think it is the Rated Rookie Nostalgia. we got our first pink coming up. Um, I'm thinking next year, maybe this will just be the only football set I pick up. Gridiron Kings, I like the look of these this year. Pretty nice. It's a 300-card set. Troy Anderson on the pink. Um, it's a 300-card set with um, 200 vets and 100 rated rookies. And yes, they're all rated rookies now. They changed that last year instead of it being just like the top 50 rated rookies and it was just everybody else. I guess they wanted everybody to get there to feel special, so they made everybody a rated rookie. So it's a lot of rated rookies. Vilas Jones... But at least you're getting, um, you know, at least you're going to get the, the parallels are dedicated to the rated rookies, but it's a hundred. So you got a little bit of a long shot to hit the guy you want. So Purdy is in this set, of course, that he's been, he's in it a lot, actually. I was surprised how much Purdy they snuck into this one. His autos are, I think some of them are redemptions. A little scratching on this guy here. So not great on that. Um, but um, yeah, I think I might... We'll see how much of this end up opening on the channel. We did a lot last year, of course, with the with that rookie class. And it was still hard to find. Oh, there we go. That's one of the variations. Damien Pierce on the black and white variation. And then Jelani Woods on the pink. So we'll sleeve that one up. I do like I do like the look of those. I wonder how many of the rated rookies have the variation. Last year I think it was only like 25, 30. It was like the portrait shots of all the folks, which was kind of wasn't the best photos, but it was something. Something different. And then yes, I have seen these. These are the legendary logos. Kind of carry forward from last year. And these are all prisms, I believe. Yeah. So there we go for box number one. Nothing crazy there. Did hit the variation. But we're looking for Pickett. We're looking for Purdy. We're looking for a downtown. Wrong 49er. We'll see if Danny Gray does anything this year. <clears throat> He's got a better road ahead of him than uh, TDP, that's for sure. You can get autos out of these two. Um, actually, RPSs. Um, so instead of RPAs, I guess. But there's Brady in his last 
And his last card. Oh, there we, oh it's all Boso. thought it was going to be Nick. Joey Bosa on the Rising Sun is one of the new inserts this year. Brian Robinson on the pink. Do you like the purple shocks more than the pink? So probably will pick up a couple Walmart boxes. Uh, those are going to be going for 35 bucks, I believe. I think you can get those online already. Neil, Quay Walker, not hitting the big guys yet. But yeah, it was kind of weird to see this released even before um, before the hobby comes out. Hobbies are going to be like five to six hundred bucks for eighty cards, which is a little rich for me. Um, I mean, I might I might still get one, but I don't want to. Garrett Wilson, is that a scratch on there? Uh, looks like it's just part of the picture. All right. Yeah, it'd be nice to get Hollow of Wilson, of Sauce, Brees Hall. Jets got a loaded class in there. I actually thought I'd buy them in a couple breaks, but still can't pull the trigger on it. Gotta, sometimes they cost more than the Niners do. Oh, see, we got a little another little quality issue here with that nasty little dimple on TJ Watt. Chris Olave on the pink. That's good. But yeah, I do like these cards. It's 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 funny how the difference just the chrome makes because I didn't dig Donruss football, which is the exact same design. But it just doesn't have the premium feel. Oh yeah, that's one of the uh, retro series cards. These are prisms as well. Frank Tarkenton on that one. We got five cards in that pack. We got two rated rookies. Yeah, so that means we're probably going to get three. In, oh, that was it. Shoot, that was box number two. So it goes by so fast. Only 24 cards. So, so far, nothing crazy. I would say two dud packs. Just a base Garrett Wilson. And then, okay, we've got the Olave pink or oh, whatever. Troy Anderson on the silver. Why are we getting five cards per pack now? That's the second one in a row. Okay. Weird. We got double dipped on the rated rookies again. You're supposed to get one rated rookie, two base, and one parallel or insert. Why can't you ever get the pack that's got like the picket and the purdy double dipping, huh? Oh, we got a rookies. Trail on Burks. Yeah, okay. And last year's, I don't know. I'll have to look at last year's again to see if I like that one more. Karloftis. Carson Strong. Who will probably never get a chance to play. Come on. Let's see. Can we get a downtown in the last three packs here? Kamara, Mills, Brees Hall. There we go. We will sleeve that one. That's probably the best card we've gotten so far. We should have a good recovery season this year probably would have been the offensive rookie of the year last year if he had stayed healthy <clears throat> i don't know man the jets are going to be fun to watch at least interesting to watch with all those weapons and now rogers being there let's see justin fields third year justin fields weird aj terrell Again, we're getting five cards. Like, we're just getting... We're getting extra cards. Can you just throw a... Oh, this one's really thin. <laughs> this one might only have three cards in it. Yeah. Only has three. Who's our... Rookie, ETN, and... Nope. Not gonna do it there. Last pack. Maybe this one's got three cards, too. So it all averages out. The machine... Never gives you a freebie. They give and they take. So, let's see what we got here. We got a My House, looks like. Who is the My House? So, oh, oh, hey, we'll take that. A little purdy My House. I, I'm shocked that they have a My House of his. I think I remember seeing that in the, uh, in the uh, checklist, but it is kind of funny. I mean... My house after seven games, which I didn't lose any of them. 
what an interesting season this is going to be. It's no secret around here. I'm a Niner fan, but I'm a Lance fan too. But uh, we'll see what happens. So there you go. That's probably the hit of the video. The Brock Purdy My House. So this is, I could probably sell this for 50 bucks today and buy it back for five in like two months, right? <laughs> we'll see. I'm going to go check out. It's interesting that we got this early. I might actually send this out to PSA. This is Prism, technically, right? Yeah. I think they're all Prism. Yeah, PSA still doing their $16 2023. We'll see. And by the way, if you haven't already been keeping up with our 178 card PSA multiple part series, uh, the next three parts should be coming in this upcoming week. So set up your notifications if you want to see some additional PSA card reveals, but, um, also we'll be doing some more optic. This probably won't be the last, this, this is not going to be the only three boxes I rip. I'm probably going to get some more of this. I think I'm going to skip select and I just like the rated rookie. What can I say? I'm a sucker for it. So, um, anyways, there we ended on a high note there. We got the breeze hall pink and the Purdy my house, probably the best two cards. Oh, we did get the variation of, of Pierce, but you know, probably a lower shot of pulling that card, of course. But, uh, yeah, we'll be doing some Purdy hunting on the channel and uh, ripping open some Optic. So stay tuned for that. And, again, thanks for watching. If you haven't already, give us a like and a sub. We're on our way to 2,000. And um, drop me a comment. Let me know if you've got yours early as well, uh, what the best pull you've gotten so far. And uh, we'll see you guys in the next video. Talk to you later. Bye. Thanks.